Hello everyone, just to let you know we have a Guy Fawkes nights here in London, uh, well in UK for that matter. In case you don't know who Guy Fawkes is, just google it please. So you might hear some of the fireworks in the background, ignore that. On with the video. As reported by Elon Musk a few weeks ago, SpaceX is on a schedule to perform first Starship test later this month. SpaceX is hard at work to ready first Starship Mark 1 test vehicle for SARP orbital test flight. SpaceX has moved its first orbital test vehicle to a launch pad from where it plans to launch the Monster rocket. The company filed documents with the US regulatory agency this week in advance of the flight, which lists maximum altitude of 22.5 kilometers, which is a far cry from low Earth orbit, but still much greater distance versus the paltry 350 meters achieved by the Starhop administrations a few months ago. First Starship test to follow successful Starhopper test performed a few months ago when Starhopper managed to reach 150 meter altitude, hover for a few seconds and land on the adjacent pad. Test performed as designed without any hitch, something SpaceX and Elon Musk hope to happen with first orbital test vehicle, likely to happen in only a few weeks time. SpaceX started to assemble Starship Mark 1 earlier this year, something I already reported on on my channel. However, the presentation on 28th of September slightly delayed actual Starship Mark 1 test, as canard wings on top part of the Starship had to be removed. Originally, SpaceX hoped to test Orbital Starship Mark 1 in October. In past few weeks, Starship underwent modifications and a new crew compartment was added earlier last week. New canard wings reattached. Entire contraption was then moved to the launch pad, where SpaceX will perform a number of tests and pre-flight tests before actual orbital tests, which I expect could happen within weeks if SpaceX gets clearance from FCA. Although SpaceX sought 5,000 permission for Starhopper with permission still pending at the time of 150 meter flight test, it seems SpaceX had abandoned the idea of performing 5,000 meter test. Instead, 22 kilometer orbital flight test will be performed with a Starship. Elon Musk confirmed that prep was underway via a tweet indicating SpaceX is close to testing the Starship and the actual orbital test could happen later this month or early in December. Elon Musk has previously said that he hoped to follow the Starhopper's most recent and final successful test quickly with a test of the full-scale vehicle. Like with that low-altitude test, SpaceX will aim to launch and land the Starhopper with touchdown planned just a short distance away. SpaceX started assembly and construction of the Starship Mark III prototype. Starship Mark III will be the first Starship SpaceX hopes to launch beyond 160km orbit or low Earth orbit. This test could happen as early as late April 2020. This is if all goes well. Starship Mark IV will be the first actual Starship SpaceX hopes to utilize commercially. Work on Starship Mark IV should start in mid-December, with Starship Mark IV ready for flight tests sometimes in May 2020. SpaceX Starship is the next generation of SpaceX spacecraft designed for maximum reusability and with the aim of creating one vehicle that can serve the needs of current and future customers, eventually replacing both Falcon 9 and Falcon Heavy. Starship is also the key ingredient in Musk's ambitious plan to reach and establish a continuing human presence on Mars and throughout the solar system. If you like this video, please press like and consider subscribing. Thank you.